What's up guys, Sick Crazy here, and today I'm bringing you guys a Riot Team Deathmatch game. I go 32 and 10, I believe. Um, so as you can see, I'm kind of used to AW at this point. Uh, I got this game yesterday, uh, which was Day Zero. Uh, I got a lot, a lot of the gameplays you guys are going to be seeing is from Day Zero. I, I was just flipping through the classes just to see what I had. I went off in this game, and um, I was getting really hyped. Um, so... But today's topic, there's a few topics for today's video, um, but questions I'm getting asked a lot are, will I be coming back to competitive and advanced warfare, and if so, why or why not? Um, well, the answer it hasn't been, I can't definitely tell off of one day of Call of Duty. Um, you have to get used to a game, you have to know if the game's good or not. Um, and it's something like, sorry, um, it's something that I really am going to have to think about, and on Twitter I kind of made it sound like it was a definite thing, it was more meant to be a kind of sort of joke, um, I said I would be teaming with Tragic Thunder and Tragic Storms, well the joke about that was Storms and Thunder and I hated each other and, and Ghosts. Uh, we ended up becoming friends in the end. We're all friends, so that's what I want you guys to realize. They're in. I'm no, they're not in this game, but I'm talking to them in this game. Um, and we're all friends. Um, thing is, I would never pick up Storms, not because of his skill. He's got a lot of skill in Advanced Warfare so far. We've been playing a lot of uh, ranked playlists, and he's been dropping like 10, 11 caps in uplink. Um, because we were going to originally pick him up, and then I talked to Thunder, and I was like, alright, well, um, I don't want to pick him up too much, because, not because of skill, but because I feel like I want to start going to local lands, because there's a lot of lands in New Jersey and inside the city, um, and I just want them to, I just want to be able to go to them without flying him out. Uh, one second. I'm sorry about that. Um, anyway, I just want to make sure we can go start going to them and play, start placing well at them. Um, so that's something that I hope for um, is to start going to local lands. So if I do come back to competitive, my team will be Thunder, Thunder, Twist, and we will be debating on Shadows or somebody else, um, depending on when Shadows can get the game. Um, and Twist I've already talked to, uh, I still gotta talk to him about some more details, um, but if I do come back, I'd be like an AR kind of support slayer, I'd kind of help control spawns, but it wouldn't be the main slayer, um, but what, like, we were playing with a full party in ranked playlists, I was dropping 30 bombs every game, I know it was ranked playlists, so it's not, it doesn't mean that much, but I'm just saying, like, I would drop 30 or 40 kills a game. Um, and Ryan would drop 40 kills every game, so, um, we're just hoping that, uh, it stays like that, and that, that's not just a phase, um, and we're really looking, I'm really looking forward to it, uh, so if, if you guys, I know I said I would kind of answer it quickly, but, um, so the short answer is maybe, um, definitely gonna try it out see if I like it. Um, I'm not going to let it get to the point where it feels like a job like I did with Ghosts. Uh, I hated Ghosts. If you guys didn't know that, um, don't know where you've been. I've said it multiple times on my channel. but um, I hated Ghosts and I just kind of got on just to play competitive so I wouldn't have to hear it from my teammates. And since I'm the captain, I really won't, and I talked to them about it like we won't be able to really be able to grind on weekdays. We'll be able to grind all weekends, though. Um, it's something that we really have, or really are looking forward to, is just grinding with each other and expanding our like friendships with each other. Because uh, that'll be a lot of fun to do. Um, so I really am cons highly considering coming back, um, especially since after day one, uh, I'm still excited to play again, and, um, 
like I said in my video, I'm still excited for that carpal tunnel syndrome I'm gonna get. Um, I'm kind of, I'm kind of half joking. Um, I'm not excited for it, but I know I'm probably gonna end up with it. Um, but yeah, like, I probably will just make a final decision. That will definitely be announced on Twitter. Um, and you guys will know I'll make a video about it once I make the final decision. I'll probably have to play the game for like a week or so and make sure and like let them come out with the rules. I might even wait till after Columbus. Um, maybe even after Orlando. Uh, actually, I don't know when Orlando is, so I'm not even gonna say that. But I'll have to wait until at least after Columbus probably to make a decision. Um, but another thing that I'm gonna do is instead of quitting whenever I just get fed up or I'm about to get dropped from a team, I'm just gonna say, all right, we need to take a break. Um, and I had. Uh, in Ghost, I was so concerned about keeping my reputation of never getting dropped from a team in Ghost and Black Ops 2. Um, but that would have been a lie if I said I've never been dropped from a team because I was dropped from three teams in MW3. Um, more because of my attitude in MW3. I was a really, I was a really cocky squeaker in MW3. That's really all how I can describe myself. Um, I was really cocky in MW3. I thought I was going to go somewhere, and. You see now, I'm not anywhere, really. I mean, 163 subscribers or whatever I'm at now is awesome. And don't think I, I'm not grateful for that. But I'm just saying, it's, compared to other channels, it's not that much. Um, and, I, I mean, I'm grateful for it. I just hope to grow more. And I, I thought, I, like, as soon as I made my first YouTube video, I would grow and be, be the next Nade Shot or be the next Scumpy. And... You see, now I, I ended up quitting competitive and ghosts, and most of the times when I quit, it was because I was about to get dropped, it, at, or uh, because of attitude problems on the team. Um, there was three times I was about to get er, there was three times I was about to get dropped, and one time where I, I, there was an attitude problem, and I couldn't take it. Um, I quit four times in ghosts, and I really do regret it. Um, regret not sticking with it because competitive was something I loved. Um, and it's still something I love to this day, and I just hope that I make the right decision and I'm happy with my decision. Because um, it's definitely something that's fun to watch, but it, it, my question to myself is, if it, is it only fun to watch for me, or is it something I would love to play again? And uh, that's something I'm going to be thinking about a lot over the next couple weeks. Um, and you guys may think it's a, it's a stupid game, why is he thinking so hard about this decision, but... It's something I really have to make sure I'm happy with because if I'm not happy with it, then what's the point of even trying? I guess you can say like, like why should I? Why should I play if I'm not going to be happy? And why shouldn't I play if I'm not going to be happy? Like if you guys get what I mean. But I, I mean, the most I'll, I'm like, what I might do is if I can't come up with a decision, I might play it every once in a while and see if that keeps me happy and if not I'll just come back I'll see what I can do I'll see what I want to do um, like I said it's gonna be until after Columbus till I make my decision most likely um, and I know there's that reputation of me quitting and I just hope to put that behind myself um, I do regret quitting all the time uh, I wish I was more mature about how I handled those situations um, and that's really all I'm gonna say on the matter of me quitting and maybe possibly me coming back. So that's going to do it for this video, guys. Comment, like, subscribe. Follow me on Twitter. It'll be down in the description below. As always, guys, this has been Sick Crazy. Hopefully you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.